Hello guys, good day to you all. This is Million Majesty. This is another video on how to use e-token or hardware token. If your bank is not giving you hardware token or they are not having, then how to make use of your electron token to access your internet banking. So I would like you guys to watch this video to the end and don't miss the step because I'll be putting you through step by step. And then if you are linked to this channel, kindly subscribe to this channel and get new and updated updates so let's just get into the work let's go to our play store right now and then if you are using iphone just go to your apple store so click on play store so this is play store right now then if you are using an apple store so go to your apple store then go to the search button then search for zenith bank hardware token okay so i did bring it as for me so click on it so this is just because i have it on my phone so no need of downloading again so you can just click on download and you download it it's not you can see it's trusted with uh, it's trusted with um 100 100 000 plus downloaders so you can see you can just download it then so let me just put you through how it works so after downloading in the go to then click on open so this is the app right now so you can see the app a token so click on open it then so just because i'm using them um, i already have account to them so i want to use another account on my zen that is why i just put this uh, multiple space you understand so click on the e-token app I just want to show you how to activate it then click on continue then after clicking on continue click on individual so enter it with your debit card hope you can see debit card enter it with your debit card then okay so put down your account number so i'm going to put down my account number right now five nine 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 okay so i'm in i'm entering my account number then after that enter the last six digits of your card that is okay i'm entering it now so i'm blocking it just because of um, security you understand then uh, enter your password you use so i block all these things just because of security you understand me so click on continue so so after continue then an sms will be sent to the number you used to open this account so let us to receive the sms okay this is the sms at the top then i'll click on copy then i'll come in then i paste it here then i'll validate it do you understand so after validating it it will just pop out um i should create a password okay you can see create your four digits pin confirm your four digits pin so i can easily create my four digit pin so i'm blocking this just because of security also so i'll just click on finished so after clicking on finish so i can easily get a uh, generate otp here yeah? you can see otp i can generate another otp another otp another otp you understand so uh, you can be generating otp here yeah? instead of you getting otp to your um to your phone directly so you'll be getting it in the app and then this one is not a uh, uh, good and have a lot of advantage you understand so the hardware token you went to go and collect in bank also can work the same way this one works this one too can work the same way that one to work the only difference between the down is uh, you're having the physical but this one you're having the software you understand and now if you want to go and collect it in bank you are going to be charged uh, 2500 now for some bank some bank 2000 era you understand so you can be using this one so after i got in this one then you go to you just have to okay sorry so you just have to go back to bank you have to go to bank then request for internet banking you understand me after go to your internet banking you fill the form after filling the form after filling the form then they will generate a login details for you you understand so after generating a login details for you so you have to go to your browser your chrome your chrome browser just click on plus then enter www.zenit.com so after entering it then you see at uh at this top login 
you can see login here you can see login there so click on login then click on personal so after clicking on personal okay my car uh, sorry i i have to block this because my google is bringing it out right because i save it on my google so you just click on the uh, pin you click on password you can say change it to password then you input the account number here yeah? then you put the account number i'm coming so you input the account number two four five okay so you put the account number you understand then okay let me be done with that so after including the account number then the password the password the bank gives you so you use the password to enter this um site force do you understand after entering it with the password first then it will take you to another page of which we are going to put the password the bank gives you the login details the bank gives you so you input the login details after inputting the long login details then uh, on the new password you want you input it also you understand so that is everything about e-token and internet banking so don't forget to subscribe see you in my next video bye